what can compare with the thrill of a brand new bike? Those long days of wishing and waiting are finally over, and the proud new owner can look forward to enjoying his bike in many ways. For bicycling is a healthy, active sport, enjoyed by almost everyone. Not only does it provide vigorous outdoor exercise, but it means quick, easy transportation to and from school. It's a nice, fast way of getting from one place to another. And it may even be a means of earning money. You're taking a lot of responsibility in owning and riding a bicycle. For you are now an operator of a wheeled vehicle. You are the automobile driver of tomorrow. And good, safe bicycle riders often turn out to be the best drivers. No good pilot would think of flying an airplane that was not in perfect condition. He knows that his very life depends upon his plane, so he inspects it carefully before flying. So you should check your vehicle, your bike, to see that everything is in good condition. If you don't know how to check your bike, get a bike mechanic to help you. Check to see that the handlebars, grips, and pedals are tight. Adjust the seat so that your knee is slightly bent when the pedal is all the way down. Be sure that the chain and sprocket are well guarded. No check is complete unless spokes are tight. Every bicycle should have a bell or horn for use as a warning signal. If your bicycle is to be ridden at night, it should have a headlight which is visible for at least 500 feet. And it should have a tail light or at least an approved reflector. And finally, your bike must have good brakes. Your life may depend on it several times a day. But keeping your bike in top condition is only the beginning. Cars. Trucks, buses, and bicycles, all are vehicles. All must obey the traffic laws. Keep to the right side of the road or street. That side is for slowly moving vehicles. When riding in a group, ride in single file at the extreme right of the roadway. Be sure to keep a safe distance behind the bike ahead of you. Before riding out of alleys or driveways, stop to be sure the way is clear. When crossing heavily traveled streets or highways, it's better to dismount than walk across with your bike. This precaution gives you a much better chance of avoiding the passing cars. Turning left at a busy intersection is a problem for the bicyclist. The best way is to ride across the intersection and stop at the far right corner. Then, as soon as the light changes, turn and ride off in the new direction. Every bicyclist should know the proper hand signals and should use them when turning or stopping. Be sure you know what the correct signals are in your community and use them at all times. Before turning left, be sure to look behind you. This will keep you from turning into the side of a passing automobile. Signal before you begin to turn. Then make the turn with both hands on the handlebars. Even stops require signals while you're on the street. Carry parcels or books in a basket or luggage carrier. You need both hands free for proper operation of your bike. 
Never carry anything which obstructs your view of the road. Your bicycle was made to carry one person. To carry more is not only bad for the bike, it's downright dangerous. Never, never hitch a ride. The slightest bump in the pavement could easily throw this boy into the path of an automobile. This is illegal in most communities, and for good reason. If you want to do tricks like these, stay out of the street. Stunting and racing should be done in vacant lots or protected areas, away from pedestrians and traffic. Too much speed makes your bike harder to control and is especially dangerous when riding down a steep hill. When riding at night, be sure to wear light-colored clothing so motorists can see you more easily. Park your bike in a safe, proper place, standing upright. This is better for your bicycle, and it keeps people from stumbling over it in the dark. A lock on your bicycle is good protection against thieves. There's more to safe bicycle riding than just remembering the rules. You must be alert. This young man is not thinking about what he's doing. He's in danger because he's unconscious of what's going on around him. Learn to be an alert bicycle rider. You'll find that it helps you to avoid accidents. The bicyclist who weaves all over the road in front of motorists is asking for trouble. He confuses the motorist, and he acts as though he might be somewhat confused himself. If you remember the rules for safe bicycling, you'll know what these riders are doing wrong. What's wrong with the way this cyclist signals for a left turn? Do you think the parents of this boy would be proud of the way he's learned to ride his new bike? Will this girl's mother be happy when she sees her coming home with the groceries, if she gets there? Why is this young man likely to spend some time in the hospital soon? This is Johnny's dad coming home with the groceries. Johnny's been trying to get his allowance raised. Poor Johnny. If he'd only remembered to put that bike away. As a bicycle owner and rider, you have a responsibility to care for your bike properly and operate it safely. It's your duty to obey the traffic rules, to be alert and quick-witted, to look out for the other fellow as well as for yourself. As a good, safe bicyclist, you'll be respected by the people of your community, for you are proving to your friends and neighbors that bicycling can be both fun and safe.